Welcome everyone to FTSvideos.com. Jay Marks here, your certified health and exercise specialist. Ultimate dumbbell workout number five. We're gonna start with your alternating dumbbell, incline dumbbell chest press. Now this is the fifth installment in this routine. And again, remember this routine, you wanna pick, excuse me, the same weight for all the same exercises. So you're not running around trying to get a different weight. Stay in the same area and we're gonna hit your chest, your legs, your back, and your abs. Good. Now, moving right to your second exercise, we're doing a stationary lunge, hammer curl for those biceps, and a shoulder press for your shoulders. Okay? Now, stationary meaning you're not moving that front leg. Good. Breathing out. In real time, you would actually probably be doing anywhere from 8 to 10 reps aside. And make sure you do both legs. So we're going now upper chest to leg. Good. Switch legs just for a second. Watch the transition here. Nice, step back, good. And hammer. Do it as three separate exercises. Okay, so here's the lunge. Nice, stand right up. Hammer and press. Try not to do all three at the same time. You wanna make sure you stay nice and straight. Good, and then we're gonna move right to your back exercise. Alternating dumbbell rows. Third exercise now, alternating dumbbell rows for your back. So you're gonna lean forward, 45 degree angle, and you alternate one side at a time. You're not seated here or you don't have your hand in any place on the bench. We want to get your legs working because you just worked your legs. So it's going to actually get a little harder here. It looks easy, but after doing those lunges, your heart rate will be up. Nice, good. Now, if you want to make it a little more advanced, you can just simply kick one leg out. Okay, off right off the floor. Oh, yeah, oh, that's right. And alternate like this. Good. Didn't know I was going to do this, so that's it. Stand up a little straighter. Good. I like to throw in these little uh, variations last second. So it's still alternating with your leg up, got your core working. Awesome. And then you go to your final exercise. Final exercise, your abs. You're still using the same weight, just one of them. Press it right up over your chest. And what you're going to do now is crunch up and drive up, hold, and then down slow. And I'm having you do it on the bench, narrow bench. You're going to feel like you're going to fall. And this movement here, you're going to work those obliques. Okay, so right from chest to legs to back to abs, using the same weight, using the same area. Great way to do a quick pump. Good, now lift your legs straight up. It's gonna get a little harder now. Good, there you go. Now work in the upper abs and your lower abs as well. Just give me different variations. Check the end of this video to see reps and sets and how many weeks to do it, how to add in your cardio with it as well. So this routine really would take Maybe 30 minutes, you add a 15 minute cardio routine and you're out of the gym in 45 minutes. Awesome. Bring those legs down and rest. And we'll see you next time. We're